Okay, so a lot of you have been asking for a tour of the Throwboy office, so here we go. So this is the outside hall. We have some of our photos on the wall here. We have some more on this side. There are other offices in this building on both sides. But here is where we are. So this is our little office. Let's start with this side. So this is our new wood wall. Well, faux wood wall. It uh, looks like our website. And it's actually really cool because it's magnetic wallpaper. So we just got it and we're gonna start using it to display like fan photos and stuff right now. Oops, <laughs> right now it's a picture or it's a little card we got from our friends at Espionage Cosmetics. I think I might have messed up the magnet. Okay, maybe, there we go. So, um, yeah, so we have a little whiteboard here. We try to write little things as they come. And then we have our little bench when people come over. Usually the people sit here and we have our little throw babies right here on this rack. We wanted to see what it would look like on kind of a store rack. So we bought this and usually when people stop by, we ask them what's their favorite emoji and then we grab one and give it to them. One of the perks of dropping in on us. Um, so we have some more down there just kind of tucked away and a couple more pillows tucked away. We have, we try to utilize this space as best we can. So everything is really strategically put into little nooks and stuff. So this is our little inspiration cubby. We kind of stuff this with anything we think is cool or any companies that we're liking right now. We even have an old original Ninja Turtle back there. And some of my favorites are this bear. I really like this one. It's from Berry Calm. And yeah, just cool design. Anything that just kind of sparks inspiration. I always like to keep this kind of stuff around. Um, I really like these from Disney, the Tsum Tsums. And I got this off Etsy from Lottie's Creations. So yeah, I just like to have that kind of stuff. So we decided to put it here for now. Um, we have just some random <laughs> stickers and oh, some more plush toys. We we keep a lot of plush toys around Throw Boy just to look at things like oh, how big is their tag and like how what's the material they use and all this kind of stuff. And we have lots of stickers in there and envelopes. Molly's probably not gonna like that I showed that mess. <laughs> um, yeah, some ugly doll. And then we have other things, business cards, some magazines that we've been in, so on and so forth. This side of the wall, there's me. So our um, office has this outside window that looks out into this, um, I guess they're called an atrium, I think it's called. And so you can see the other offices and the other people across the way right there. And there's this new like kind of art fixture thing up there and there's some stairs that people can see us through. So it's actually really handy. That's why we decided to make this um, box here, this acrylic box, so we can kind of show off what Throwboy is. And even when we're not in the office, people can see what we do. So we made this out of just some acrylic that we got at the hardware store. And then it was just enough space to where we could stuff pillows down it. And then uh, Molly and Justin, sat here and arranged these in a very uh, like pseudo random order, but they actually have a lot of uh, reasoning for being like that. But it ended up looking really cool. So I'll take a spin around the other side and we can see it. And so this window is a little bit tinted, so you don't really see like the natural light, but it's cool for being able to see outside or people to see into our office. Down, down there, this is the fifth floor that's co-working. There you can see some other people working over there and they're putting in a new staircase right here. So we'll get a lot more exposure of people walking up and down from the co-working space downstairs, which is nice. We have our little clock on the wall. Everything is like pops of color all over the Thoroughboy office. Our calendar, 
one of the other really cool things about this um, wall here, we put in this projector screen. So this used to be just a normal blinds like this. And we thought, hey, <laughs> you know what we could do is actually just take that and modify it. And then we could have a screen and we could project, you know, anything we wanted, movies or, you know, PowerPoint or whatever. So <clears throat> we'll pull this down here. So now we have this sweet screen and we bought this at the hardware store for like next to nothing. It was a really cheap job to be able to do this. And the projector is right over here. So that's this side of the wall. Hopefully I can get this thing back up. <laughs> oh yeah. All right. And we got a little cubby right here. Or just random things. We try to, if we have any clutter, we try to just kind of like put it away. So it's not showing. Cause again, we have a window right here, but these boxes, I'm not proud of that. I got to get rid of that. Here's our other wall where we showcase the pillow fighters. And Justin's working on some sticky note stuff on the wall there. <laughs> That's usually not there. Um, all of these pillow fighters uh, I handmade myself. These are actually all of the original pillow fighters that I made, um, starting with the top one, the all white one, which was when I was just starting that idea. We put it up here for inspiration because we are working more on the pillow fighters entirely like the concept and everything that's going to go around it including eventually doing these again hopefully um and <clears throat> so we leave it there we like it it's just kind of a nice thing again like having inspiration on the wall is always kind of a thing i like to have and um if you've never checked these out this is what these look like and again i made all of these um, actually all of the pillow fighters um i made myself i didn't have anybody helping me for for these guys so this is kind of fun to reminisce for me <laughs> to look back on all this stuff that I used to do um, so over here we have our little print printer oh we have a rogue <laughs> turtle pillow fighter over there by the way they have their little shells um, and we have a little file cabinet really proud that we could find this matching file cabinet and then on this side is uh, our other wall which is just our logo focus and that is our uh, logo that I made out of uh, wood I made this sign um, about a month ago with uh, just some repurposed wood that I found at a scrapyard <clears throat> I'll let you see it a little bit closer so yeah I took a uh, carving tool to this and kind of like scooped all that out and carved or um, cut around the edge and did all that and that was really fun because I haven't been doing a lot of artistic projects for a while so I was like eh I don't need to pay someone for our sign I'll make it so I made that sign and then finally let me wrap around here and you can see our desks so we have our little desk clump in the middle here with our fancy chairs so Molly and Justin like to sit on these buoy chairs, which are, they kind of rock, and then they also have a little adjustable height handle on them. I think you do this. Yeah. <laughs> so they like to sit on those and spin around. Good for your posture. Um, as you can see, we have lots of toys all over the place. Try to keep the fun, colorful spirit around here. Um, my desk is right here. And I have the standing desk, the uh, very desk thing. So usually I try to stand up most of the day. Uh, we have the old ICEO sitting here. One of our OG um, old school products from back in 2012. Got to have that. Another little old school reminder of how far we've come along. And then we have this uh, projector, like I was saying. We have these buckets on the side of my desk and they are used for ideas. So yellow is YouTube, blue is blog. And so whenever we have uh, an idea like for a blog post or YouTube video, we literally put it in a bucket and uh, then draw from it when we need more ideas to, to draw from. Um, another thing that we like to do here is we put sticky notes for to-do lists, which I totally 
ripped off from Romina. You should check her out. She's youtube.com slash redromina. And basically, you just write your little to-dos on these stickies when you're done, grab it, throw it away. So that way you don't have like this long list all the time. This is my little desk. And again, it raises, but I can't really raise it with one hand. It raises and it lowers, which is nice. So whenever I get tired, I just lower it. Um, some more fun color for you. What is this from, everybody? Does anyone know? I know some of you know. And just some little random things I have on my desk, like my little sewing machine, um, pencil sharpener. Here's my little Spider-Man. Um, what are these called? Uh, scalers. You put these on like wires and stuff, but I like to throw them on this upside down. Um, and yeah, and we all have pencil cups that are different colors. So yeah, lots of color and just kind of keeps it fun. My little headphone, um, what's it called? Headphone hook. And that's pretty much the office back around. Oh, and we have some, uh, hooks for our, clo for our coats, which we no longer need because it's super hot here. And we have our little hook for our keys for the mailbox which now is decked out with lots of keychains before it just had this guy. And that's the current state of Throwboy. We're now in, uh, what is it, almost June 2015. So look back on this in <laughs> some years time and you'll be like, whoa, craziness. Oh, one more thing. Let me wrap around so you guys can see the other side how people see us from the other side so this is down the hall hang left again some other businesses here and right through here is where you can see throw boy from the outside which is really cool this is all done by the other guys so this always catches eyes and we always are <laughs> hearing people come in and go, Hey, I saw your pillows outside and I wanted to come in and say hi. And so we always love hearing that. And they're putting in a new staircase right here. They're almost done, which will give us a lot more traffic flow. We hope so more people get to see throw boy from out here. So everybody, I hope you liked this little tour video. And don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and leave us a comment. Tell us what you think of the old Throwboy office. All right, I will catch you in the next video. See ya.